Hi everybody, welcome back to another episode of Hummingbird Quick Tips. On this one, we're gonna be talking about the Fish Smart app that's totally free from Hummingbird. You can download it onto uh, any, any uh, modern cell phone device. Um, today, I'm gonna talk about how to transfer or, or update your software. In the old days, or up until just recently, you'd have to go to the Hummingbird website you would have to put in SD card into your computer. You'd have to scroll to find the, the actual uh, unit that you have. And then you'd have to put the software updates onto that SD card. Then once it was on there, you would pull the SD card out. You would come over to your unit. You would put it into the slot. And then you'd go through the whole process of uploading it into your unit. So I'm going to show you how to do this wirelessly with your phone. And it's going to be pretty quick and easy. Before you do this, you should always reset your factory defaults. I know um, that's what Hummingbird suggests, so that's what I do. So you're going to go to Setup and scroll down. It's about midway down right here. It says Restore Defaults. I just toggle over and it says Yes or No. I'll say Yes. And if you guys are afraid to do this, if restoring the factory defaults are the reason why you're not updating your software, then I would suggest you write down all your settings, maybe on your phone in the notepad, and then, um, and then you'll be less scared to, to, uh, to change up or, or put in the new software. All right, so you can see right here on my phone that I've got a notification right here that one of my units needs to be updated and so right now i've got two units i've got a hummerbird 12 g3 generation 3 and another one uh one's on the bow and one's on the console so i had to i i named these by this menu right here to so name yours if you don't know how to do that you just go over to network you scroll down and this is where you're going to name them so you're going to want you don't have to get fancy. I put Helix 12 bow because I have two units on my bow. And then on my console, I've got two units. So I put Helix 12 console. Real simple. Okay. So what I'm going to do is click this little button here that says update. And you're going to be seeing this live. Come on. It's cold out here in my garage. So my fingers are cold. I don't know. Why that's not working. Oh, here we go. So you click on the three little dots and it says uh, download up update right here. So I click yes. And now if you can see, it's starting to scroll and it's going to take a little while. So I'll come back to you once that's done updating. So just one thing I wanted to mention while this is still downloading, it started at 10.52, so I'll let you know exactly how long it takes. You can see I'm about a quarter of the way done, and it's only been a minute. But it tells me right here what my latest software update is, which was 2.180, and the available update is 2.2, 2.280, and it tells me that it's 45 megabytes. So it's going to give you some information right there. Again, I know this camera's having trouble focusing but that's what it tells you. So I'll come back once this is done and I'll tell you how long it takes. All right, so we're just about done. We're at, uh, it's 10 o'clock, so it's been eight minutes. And you can see that this is uh, very, very close. Now, as this has been downloading, I do not see anything on the screen of the unit itself. It's not giving me any, any indication that it's doing something, but we'll see what happens once this closes up. Again, you know, eight, 10 minutes to get this done, you know, it'd probably take me that long to do it the same way via the SD card, but it'd be a lot more of a hassle because you gotta do it on one computer, you gotta let it up, you gotta toggle to the right things on the Hummingbird, web, Hummingbird website. And then once it's done, you got to come to your boat and put it in. Once you put it in in your boat, though, it does 
uh, upload very, very quickly. Okay, so it looks like it's done. And right now, I'm not getting any notification yet, so let's just look over here. Nothing there. Let's go to nothing there. I'm guessing it just takes a little bit of time. But it should be all done as far as I can tell. So that's all it takes to, um, to up, update your uh, software. Very quick and easy. I hope this helps you out and good luck on the water. Renderforest.